This is the uh, wiring of the uh, project. We have an Uno, Arduino Uno. We have a HC05 Bluetooth model. Um, and we have HDT11 temperature and uh, humidity sensor. The HC05 Bluetooth model uh, using 3.3 volts uh, on the uh, transmit and receive pins. So I had to uh, convert basically the voltage level using this uh, voltage level logic converter. Um, I'm getting a, a 5 volt from Arduino and, uh, and a 3 volt on the output. So I'm converting the uh, transmit and receive um, from here, from pin 0 and pin 1, coming here and then uh, coming out from the uh, voltage uh, converter going to the uh, transmit and receive of the uh, HC05. I will explain this on the diagram. This is just to show you the project. So this is the app. I called it Steam NOR temperature. I'm gonna click on it. So I used uh, MIT uh, inventor app and I'm gonna show you the slides uh, how you can actually use it so I'm gonna click on uh, this thermometer button and I, I have to select my Bluetooth address and notes after a few seconds you have reading so you have temperature 26 degrees Celsius and humidity 34 percent so it works so uh, just want to show you the wiring diagram uh, of the project uh, this is uh, very confusing but here I will have this diagram uh, I use Fritz in uh, uh, tool uh, to create this diagram so we have our uh, logic level converter HDT uh, 11 temperature humidity sensor and our Arduino Uno board and of course you need the Bluetooth I have the HC05 uh, Bluetooth um, so basically this is needed the uh, logic level converter is needed because the uh, HC05 in the is being powered by 5 volts you still need uh, for data transmission uh, TX and uh, RX you need 3.3 volts uh, so we, we need to convert high voltage to low voltage that's why uh, this is needed and the uh, this diagram is going to be uh, in uh, YouTube and the description uh, including the code for uh, and block diagram for from uh, for MIT inventor app so this is the uh, sketch I uploaded into Arduino. I used a simple DHT uh, library and uh, with serial communication function. So basically, if I click on this button on the IDE, you will see temperature and uh, something's wrong with this one, but temperature and humidity is being transmitted on uh, serial communication. So it's this data that will be transmitted on the uh, on the on the Bluetooth. So here is your uh, setup function, and here is your loop function, and I will talk about this code later on in detail. Okay. So basically, there are um, that sensor DHT is giving us both temperature and humidity. So I use this character here to split the data. And I will show you uh, how I can retrieve each value separately. So the other application I used uh, to build this project, it's called MIT uh, App Inventor. It's free, you can download it from uh, the internet. I will, I will uh, put a link into it also with the, including the code. So uh, in this application, 
you have two spaces uh, one for designing your app this is your user interface where you can use uh, buttons check boxes labels uh, list picker anyway all this uh, component that you need for your project and uh, and the other uh, space this is your block diagram this is where all the logic basically and math goes in and I will go through all, all this okay and just to show you for example uh, remember I mentioned that uh, pipe I used to split data this is uh, this is how it works you know basically it, it's just like Lego you block diagram basically you 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 select your block diagrams uh, for specific components and you just put them there to create a logic uh, code okay as you have notes I have used uh, this temperature humidity uh, sensor this is HTT 11 uh, but for our mobile app uh, we will be using and actually I use that to just to test the uh, the project we're going to be using an infrared uh, temperature sensor this is a GY906 and also uh, I talked about applications I used IDE Arduino uh, for uh, writing code and also the uh, building the mobile app I used uh, MIT inventor app uh, I'm gonna talk about every application